All right, here's this story from Jafin. It's uh, called A Bittersweet Day, a Star Trek short story. Let's see if I can do his story justice. Here we go. Today was Joe's retirement day at the space dock after a long career. His environmental suit is scarred and pitted, patched many times over. Next to him stands a much younger man, his suit almost new. It was Joe's grandson, newly certified to work at the dock now. In the dock floats the last ship that Joe has worked on and the first for his grandson. Joe's last act will be to wave as the ship departs, a bon voyage that he had done to every ship he has worked on. His grandfather started the tradition, sending off the USS Ares with a wave. The old timer's proudest work moment came a few months later when Captain Garth himself came to the break room, presented a letter of thanks in person, as well as a ship's patch to Joe's grandfather. From then on, it was a wave goodbye, and even scorching the name, registration, and star date into the beam somewhere on the dock structure. Joe had done the same thing through the years, being able to do so for the Enterprise, the big E as he took to calling her twice. Now it was time to step aside, let a new generation take over. This last ship, she has steel from her World War II ancestor in her. The big argument was what her registration number would be. Historians and sentimentalists insisting that it stay the same since the original ship is literally in the starship. Joseph rests his hand on his grandson's shoulder as the dock lights go out and retract along with the mooring tractor beams and support umbilicus. The ship now floats free, her maneuvering thrusters keeping her in position. The navigation and running lights of the ship come on one by one. He glances over at his grandson, wondering if his own grin is as big as that of the young man has. The ship's aft thrusters begin firing off. The vessel creeps forward out of the metal room that has been its home for a couple of years. Joe raises his arms along with his grandson, giving the ship and its crew the farewell and safe journey wish the old man has done for so long. There are crew on board the ship, waving back through the viewports. When the ship is out of the dock and underway, Joe says, Well, time to make your mark, kiddo. The young man nods, pulling a small cutting torch from his tool belt secured around his waist of his environmental suit. He turns to a support beam, and after turning on the torch, starts to scorch the ship's name and its old-style registration number into the metal. USS Hornet CV-12. I don't know about you, but I thought that was a very cool story.